I really love this place. Good vibes. The Chelomay complex was built from the ground up to be the ideal comfortable workplace. Can it, Glove? I've been here before. Will we make it for the speech? <laughs> We've got plenty of time. We can even go on rides afterwards. <laughs> the Icarus platform, a feat of modern science and technology. This city in the clouds was built in 1950. Leading scientists from all the other Soviet republics live here, including the German SSR. You need to have an exceptionally brilliant and dedicated mind to work here. Would you care for some more soda, comrade? Sure, thanks. Looks like another bot got stuck in a tree. <laughs> that always cracks me up. Is that still working on the robot's navigation system? Yeah, I noticed. Wow, what a beautiful day. With your Volvas box, Andre. They're going haywire. What the hell did you do to them? They've been like that all day. Number three is bought. I need these houses painted, but look at what they're doing instead. Give me your control code. I'll set them straight. Hold picky, sweetie. Oh, thanks, Mum. Uh, the code's 0451. Okay, then. Get to work, you bums. Move it! Move it! Whoa! You did it! Oh, thanks a million! Enjoy the celebration! Good morning, my boy. How are you? Did you sleep well? Good morning, Dr. Sechenov. I slept fine. Waiting orders. How do you like the new glove? Better than the old one. It's growing on me. I'd expect nothing less. I designed the device myself. Be careful with it now. It's more important than you might think. Yes, Dr. Sechenov. I'll keep it safe. Report to the lab to complete your integration with the glove. I've got a full schedule today, so Mikhail Stockhausen will get you up to speed. I'll be in touch later. Roger that. to the laboratory, Comrade Major. There's a turbine waiting for you at the airway. Are your orders clear? Crystal, get off my case already. I'm pleased to hear you don't have any questions, for once. You dickhead. Icarus platform residents and facility guests. The address by the Director General of Facility. Get your thought device today. Get connected straight away. An official vendor of the Soviet lottery. Buy a lottery ticket and win an apartment in Chelme City. Buy a copy of the Facility Herald, comrade. Breakthroughs abound. Biology, robotics, gunsmithing, and just in time for universal polymerization. You can't stop progress, huh? That's right. Doesn't it fill you with pride? Well, I won't take up any more of your time. Take it easy. A newspaper. What the hell do I need that for? In case you're unaware, newspapers are a source of information. I've got a talking glove on my hand.
can't I just get the information from you? Comrade Major, may I remind you that I can display information about our surroundings on your retina? It won't make you any smarter, but it will make it easier to read. Use your glove's built-in menu. <sighs> Lousy prick. Step right up. You can become part of Collective. Good day, comrade. Come closer. I'm here to help. Would you like a thought device? It's high time you got one. No, nah, thanks. I'm just browsing. Why restrict yourself to browsing when you can get your own personalized device this very instant? I can even help you pick out the right unit. It can even match your eye color. Hey, how about a gooseberry violet model, huh? You are polymerized, aren't you? I sure am. Say, I thought these devices weren't going to come online until Monday. That's right, comrade. But judging by your uniform, you are clear to activate your thought neuroconnector right away. At the moment, the device functions as a personal telephone set and headlight, but it also allows the user to get used to wearing it on their head. It, it's free, right? Absolutely. Allow me to connect you. All right, then. seem to access your biometric data. Maybe there's some sort of malfunction. I'm so sorry. Ah, don't sweat it. I'm not really a jewelry guy anyway. So no thanks. I'm all set. Let's do it one more time. But this time, make sure the atom's in the picture. Well, let's just take the picture the way we are. Say cheese! Get ready for your group photo, comrades! Come on, guys. Don't be shy. There's room. Uh, can we get the atom in the picture, and the too? And the statue, as well. Uh, everything up to there should be in the picture. It'll look great. Here's an idea. I'm a lady from the future, and you're my soldiers. Ma'am. Yeah, like this. Say cheese! Let's take another one. Any ideas? Yeah. You and Anatoly stand like the worker and the coal host woman. And you? I'll be the cosmonaut, so keep still. Say cheese! Can I move now? Come on, let's see the picture. Come on, come on. Can you show us the photograph? Uh, I think I blinked. Let's see. Ah, uh, no, I blinked. <laughs> Did you really have to make that? Let's do it one more time. Attention, comrades. Listen up. Tickets are now available to a new The robot is man's best friend, man. Eh? Interesting. I wonder if they could make a robot doll like a real one. That bot is the real deal, comrade. Residents and visitors of the Icarus Park. Comrades! Assemble near the Brown Plate Memorial for a tour. Learn about the history of Facility 3826. Everyone here seems so happy and content. Just like in China. You've been to China, Comrade Major? I've been everywhere. I mean, everywhere except for China, I guess. Facility 3826 isn't all that far from our Chinese allies. I like their spirit. And I hear it's nice there. Indeed it is. I was covered in bandages and you nursed me back to health. Oh, you were a sturdy young man. I was just the village herbalist. I was just a little I've got a question. Yes, comrade, how may I help? Well, what can you tell me about space? <laughs> That's quite a question. 
We could talk about it endlessly and still get nowhere. One thing is certain, though. The question, how should we live here on Earth, can only be answered out there. No thanks, I'm good. Major Nachai reporting for duty on Comrade Sechenov's direct order. Welcome, Comrade Major. Today is a joyful occasion. The birthday of Collective. Yeah, yeah, many happy returns. Cut to the chase, would you? I've got places to be. Naturally. This is the future of Soviet education. A personal project of Dr. Sechenov's poly education. Gone are the days when Soviet citizens had to spend years studying at educational institutions. From this moment on, just inject a special neuropolymer encoded with the education you want, a university-level natural sciences curriculum, for example, and you'll instantly become an educated member of society. Want to learn Korean? Or get a doctorate in nuclear physics? Or learn to play the piano? With Collective 2.0, you can. Yeah, 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 been there, done that. Skip the foreplay, bot. Excuse me, of course. Your particular case definitely calls for something more efficacious. Nevertheless, you will still need an initial neuropolymer injection. <laughs> Comrade Sechenov is expecting you, Agent P3. I've been informed of your imminent arrival. Here, take this capsule. your glove with scanner functionality. Using the neuropolymer as a conduit, the sensors in your glove are now directly connected to your neural system, especially your eyes, polymer retina. To activate the scanner, just make a special gesture. Please choose an object of interest and extend your arm toward it. The palm of your hand should be facing the object. Contract all the fingers on your hand except for your thumb and index finger. Extend your thumb and index finger to form a right angle to activate the scanner. Holy shit, bot. Who designed this thing? The Spanish Inquisition? Demon, be gone. <laughs> for your information, that's a highly user-friendly gesture. It was developed by our leading expert in the field of advanced interpretive avant-garde absurdist Dadaism. Whatever that guy's been smoking, sign me up. Didn't you say you were in a hurry just a moment ago? Shut your trap and keep scanning, would ya? I'm getting acquainted with the new hardware. You are now capable of seeing hidden objects. This ability could prove very useful in the future. But for now, please continue with your mission. Welcome, comrade. That's some interesting art you got there. You like it? They were made by robots for this festive occasion. I, I figured they were drawn by humans. Oh, wonderful. That means we have successfully imitated the output of a human art club. Thank you for the compliment. May I be of service? You're celebrating too? Naturally, we are part of Collective 2. For us robots, universal polymerization is our goal. Our duty, even our feet of labor. Would you like me to explain in more detail? No, no, thanks anyway. I'm in a hurry. Comrades, the address by the Director General of Facility 3826, Dr. Sechenov, is about to begin.
office for the Humans access code. Be able to control the left was one of his bodyguards. Yeah, not and yet. finally, we will be free to forget the difficult, tedious drudgery of unskilled labor and dedicate ourselves to science. On behalf of all at Facility 3826, I present to you the device of the future. I love this place. No matter how many times I come here, it always amazes me. It's just... So nice. Our elevator has arrived. A network for all mankind together. Uniting the intellect of all individuals into a powerful mind free of all boundaries. Thanks to the Thought Neural Connector, you will control robots with your mind. Mastering academic subjects with breathtaking speed. Accessing all human knowledge and of course combining it with your own individual discoveries. You will no longer need control panels, cumbersome communications equipment, and loudspeakers, documents, electronic notebooks, etc. Thought will replace every single one of them. And so much more. Your potential will be unlimited. Want to learn a foreign language in a minute? Master quantum physics in a day. Memorize literary masterpieces from around the world. This all will be possible once your Thought Neural Connector is installed right here on your temple. All communication between your brain and your personal thought device is made possible via a tiny injection of neuropolymer at a local center for polymerization, where you will also receive your thought. Talk about style. Science is power, I tell you. The boss has a way of looking down on insurmountable obstacles. I really respect that. There are no obstacles science cannot surmount. Other than an electronic glove that never shuts up. Here is your vehicle activation code, Comrade Major. 